Hey guys, again Jeff Rell for Art Planet TV and for today's video we'll be reviewing the Derwent water brushes so please stay tuned. guys i'm back with the review of this water brushes so actually i've been um thinking of buying this before because i have brushes naman ako and i even have other water brushes so now i tried um you know giving it a chance and see how good it is or if it's that good or if it's bad or something like that so there are three uh, brushes so number one two and three Yung number one yung pinaka fine and uh, number three is the flat one and then number two is the round brush so let's see how this performs and so um number one is the fine and number two is a round brush and number three was a flat brush so we will try the winsor newton um watercolor markers so para ano mas madali check natin kung um, paano siya mag-work and how it will activate the watercolor dun sa pigment. Ayan. So, kulayan ko muna siya. Pero, I'm using B paper here. Di ko na muna ginamit yung um, journal ko sa likod kasi trial lang naman. So, I, I don't want to um, waste more paper. And, yan. So, yan. Kulayan natin siya. And then, We'll use the finer brush. So as soon as you pinch it out, um, I mean it will uh, produce water depending on how you pinch it. So actually, I have mga ibang water brushes before, but it's not as good as this one. Ito kasi kung ano lang pindot mo yun lalabas. So before, I have water brushes na sobrang daming lumalabas na water or liquid from the body. Or, yan. So, ito, okay naman siya. And it's, it's good. Ayan. So, ang sarap siya gamitin. Nag, since nylon nga siya, so it will usually go with um, watercolor. Ayan. Ayan natin ulit isa pang, um, <laughs> ayan. So, if you notice, guys, medyo na ano na yung paper. Kasi nga, medyo 200 GSM lang to. So, um, pag sobrang basa siya, there's a tendency na maghimulmol yung paper nyo. Like this one. And let's try using a different color and different brush. So, I'll use um, the orange uh, marker and then I will use the round brush. Ayan. Sarap na gamitin ng marker na to. Ayan. So, let's try. Magkulay muna tayo na isa pa. For the three um, brushes, okay. And so let's use the number two brush or the round brush. And by the way, guys, tips ko para sa inyo is you have to use uh, mineral water or yung um, distilled water that you will use inside your brush or you will put inside your brush because it will contaminate yung mga paints nyo. Um, actually, there were times na nagkaroon ng, ano talaga, nagkaroon ng modes yung iba kong watercolor because madumi yung water. So, yun lang. Isa sa mga good tips that I got from other artists as well. Ayan, so ang ganda ng flow ng round brush. Nagkita nyo naman, guys. And how it activated the color. Ayan. Masarap nyo gamitin and it's really smooth kasi nga um, nylon brush siya. Though, sa mga animal hair naman, mas malambot. Pero, I don't know, ito bouncy kasi kapag nylon. Then, then, let's try number 3, which is a flat brush. Ayan. So, medyo mahirap maglagay ng um, water from uh, the glass or yung uh, from the, uh, yung para gripo ng yung mineral. So, what I did is I pinched it from I just pinched the brush and then absorb the water from the glass. So, yun yung ginawa ko para maka-absorb siya. Ayan. So, ito. Maayos din yung flat brush. Actually, um, of all the three brushes, siya yung pinaka gusto kong gamitin. Kasi, ang cute niya. So, 
um, it's uh, it's a unique um, type of uh, brush. Ayan. So it has like a bigger coverage because it's flat. Though yung round brush, if you notice, know, smoother yung ayan, smoother yung pag spread. And also it depends on the paint. So itong yellow, medyo hindi siya na ganun mag, um, activate or spread out. Ayan. So let's try naman other paints. And uh, let's try to make a, a small landscape painting. So let's use, uh, let's try to use this one, um, one of my old paints, Schminka. So I tried uh, the other half of the paper. So let's try to paint um, probably uh, sunset. Okay, so yeah. Um, I will just use some yellows and orange for this one. So I think um, this um, brush is also very good when you're a traveler and you're on the go because you don't need to um, dab, dab, dab your brush to water to um, to clean it up or to get water because it's in the water. Niya. So a good thing about this as well is if you, want, if you want to clean it up, just pinch it and then it will wash out the paint from the, uh, the end of the brush. Ayan. So I'm now trying to switch using different, uh, these different brushes. So for um, bigger coverage, I use the flat brush, and so for the mountain, I will use the round brush. And yeah. So as you notice, um, this is maganda dito is balance yung pag pinindot mo siya ko ano na yung pagpindot niyo. Ilalabas na like what I said earlier. Sa iba kasi talaga bubulwak siya. Sure. Kasi talagang sobrang daming nalabas na water. But for this one, it's not like that. And I can see that it looks really um, durable. How um, it was uh, designed. Even the um, plastic material that was used for the um, half part of the, the brush. Ayun. So, Akala-kala ko si before is sobrang tigas niya kaya ayoko siyang bilhin yun so yun pala um, okay naman and um, actually uh, parang medyo nagsisya ko dahil ngayon ko lang siya trinay but if I could have like bought it before mas siguro matagal ko rin tong gagamitin and I will be reviewing um, a set of um, inktens so this is gonna be part of my future video so actually that's this um, water brush is perfect for inktens or perfect for um, watercolor pencils or ink pencils so now I will be using um, the round brush and um, ayan so let's have it try in a few and then put the details using sa, using the um, finer brush or number one so let's try to speed it up four times because medyo natagal na ako dito sa pagpaint dahil nanonood ako nito <laughs> eh medyo mabagal ako like um, I was actually watching K series or Korean series the When the Camellia Blooms so recently medyo na hook up ko sa mga Korean uh, shows uh, simply because they can really um, touch your heart oh, again. Uh, but actually yun nga, um, I'm, I'm impressed with how they um, uh, how they play the roles tapos ibang show iba na naman yung character nila and also the cinematography that's what I like yung mga zoom out zoom in yun yung mga ganun so going back to um, this painting ayan, I'm trying to go back to um, the skies using the flat brush and by the way I'm using this um, I am using this compression um, glove because having been um my hands have been hurt. I don't know if it's because I've been playing or typing or what, but I can feel that uh, I need to um, have some, um, you know, aid on my hands. So, ayan, I will be using the uh, finer brush to um, paint for the silhouette of the trees. So, and, you know, um, just trying to play with this one and ayan siya so ayan uh, try to ano eh actually try to play with 
um, the other brushes kung ano yung mas okay. Ayan. So, let's play with it. By the way, itong Shminka is um, a very good um, set of paint. Uh, set of paints and um, it's actually high uh, light fast and um, this one is also very good for muted or mood kasi may pagka pastel yung outcome niya or yung result niya for me may pagka mute siya and yung mood mo it's some kind of gloomy so this yun yung ginagamit kapag yun yung mga mood ko or yun yung gusto ko na painting outcome and then I'm using here paints gray with mixture of purple and blue for the silhouette. Ayan, ganyan lang siya. And guys, uh, thank you for by the way, thank you for watching. I hope you like this video. Um, I have been um, getting feedback about uh, me um, not posting much of the videos or painting. I've been really very busy with my work. and But I'm trying my best to um, at least record whatever painting I can do um, every week at least once a week or in uh, two weeks time so ayan na siya. it's all dried up and um, actually uh, the finest brush is also good for brush calligraphy so that's what i am doing here trying to um, paint some letters or write some words just make it easy good vibes okay so yun na guys, and I hope you um, have a good day. Whatever you are, please stay safe. Please subscribe and hit the notification bell for my future videos. Bye!